In this short video, we're going to look at controller design using the MATLAB SISO tool. The plant problem you're going to look at is uh, defined here. The plant is a G of S equal to 1 divided by S plus 1 times S plus 2 times S plus 3, the third order plant. And the transient requirements are uh, rise time is 1, one second, uh, settling time is 5 seconds for 1% settling time, and percentage overshoot should be less than 20%. So let's go to MATLAB and let's enter the plant. So SYS is the plant using the transfer function. Now I'll use the convolve function here to uh, get my uh, transfer function in. Um, I need two convolves. And let's see, one, three. So what this convolve does is multiplies s plus 2, s plus 3 and this convolve does uh, multiply of the result of this convolve with s plus 1 and that's how you get this. So let's start the SISO tool here, SISO tool and we'll call it with a parameter which is a plant and SISO tool starts up. And what you get Im immediately is uh, these two menu, uh, these two windows here. Here you see the root locus, and here you see uh, the body plot. We'll not talk about this body plot right uh, right now. So um, what we can do is uh, look at our analysis plots. Analysis basically tells uh, analysis plot. Basically, you can look at the uh, uh, step response. So let's say I want step response in plot one, and I'll say from uh, uh, reference to uh, output y. Now on this plot, you can right click and superimpose design requirements. We'll create new design requirements, and we'll say rise time is one second, and we'll say 90% rise time, going up to 90% of the final value. Settling per, uh, time is five seconds for one person settling time, and overshoot is 20 percent. I will not look at undershoot so 20 percent. So if you do that this is your uh, design requirement. So this has to be inside this white region. Now definitely it's not. So what do we do to increase our or decrease our rise time what we can do is uh, bump up our gains like so. Uh, that does good but if you look um, it goes above and outside our um, um, percentage overshoot which I put which are limited at 20% uh, this goes outside and it go under, goes under our undershoot and doesn't settle within this so we need some other controllers here just uh, proportional controller is not going to do the job so let me to reduce steady state error let me go ahead and include uh, a PI controller so we go to compensator editor and we can add dynamics and we know as we know pi controller consists of a pole at a zero and a zero somewhere else so let's do that let's add a pole we'll add a real pole and we'll put that pole at zero and then we'll add a real zero um real zero somewhere here somewhere else okay so at one and now what you can do is uh, it looks like we've moved a lot of stuff here but uh, let's do this um, we'll zoom in here and uh, that's what i've done here is uh, put a real uh, real zero at minus one let me change it maybe i'll put it at uh, minus 0 0.5 and see what happens and there you are that's what you have uh, is it any good probably not it's uh, too slow so what we can do is bump up our gains so if I move this I can bump up my gain and there you have it I can bump up my gain still more um, it's right about going okay 
let's see and uh, maybe I zoom out a little bit more maybe I bump up my gain still more like so uh, looks like it this will not work too well uh, no matter what I do so let me go ahead and add to increase the uh, performance still more let me go ahead and add a uh, uh, PD controller so add another uh, uh, right click and add another real uh, zero and let me put that zero at maybe three or something like that minus three uh, or minus, uh, minus five instead and see what happens immediately it changes here so let's look at our hmm, uh, root locus uh, so it looks like my zero is right here now I can move around this thing and see what happens maybe bump up my gain more uh, this is, doesn't look too good so let me do that let me bring the zero here you see you can play around real nice with this and let me maybe zoom in here zoom in here so uh, and again move my zero and move my gain um, this is quite difficult to do actually but uh, you guys get the point here let's see if I do that what happens no no good so maybe I can do that and see what happens no good uh, maybe I'll put it right here and see what happens when I increase my gain that looks more like it and if I still bump it up there I think I achieved what I wanted finally and I have my settling time here so the waveform the enters through at five seconds never leaves that I have achieved my rise time goals a one second percentage overshoot goal at one second and now I can look at my controller and where did it go right here I can look at my controller here this is my controller this is my gain k this is my pi part right here i'm oh, sorry i should say this one is my pi part and this is the pd part so i have designed a pd controller uh, using the siso tool